This is Serenity Ledger's video for this 2011 Swift Contiki 669, uh, currently for sale with us. Um, it's covered a mere 18,000 miles and has some very high specification on it, uh, non-standard from factory, and is a very, very nice example, uh, having been bought directly from the previous keeper. This is the 3 litre 160 brake horsepower. Um, it's sitting on the Alco 5 ton chassis. Uh, tag axle motorhomes, six tyres altogether. Um, island bed uh, with a half garage on the back. Uh, the uh, video gives us an opportunity to sort of point out any markings to the motorhome, if we can find any. Um, but with the exception of a couple of very small pimple marks, this motorhome remains rather good, to say the least. Uh, it has got the uh, tow bar on the back, so if you want to pull the small car behind, that's how we picked it up with our little tow car. Um, bicycle rack and roof ladder up there. Front end is very good. All it can do with a bit of a polish, but we'll take care of that. But that's the only thing that needs doing on the outside, really. It's got the mirror covers. Uh, and condition-wise, much the same on this side. I will show you that small pimple mark because I was describing it to somebody yesterday. I think it's just there. See that? Uh, that is the only thing on this side. The, yeah, see anything. Very shiny otherwise. Tires are good. Gas locker box is on that side. Okay, internals. Well, it would be helpful, wouldn't it, if it was open? One moment. Uh, this literally has only just been put in the showroom, so. Right, let's get some lights on. So it had a new multimedia system in the cab not so long ago. It's got a reversing camera, cab air conditioning. Um, both seats will swivel and they're in lovely condition. It's got the nice uh, Alcantara effect interior. Cruise control, Remis blinds on the front, reversing camera up there. Uh, so this is the low line version of, the, uh, of this particular model. So no overhead cab bed, but what you do get instead is a skylight which lets in copious amounts of light. Doesn't look like it at the moment because it's inside. Upholstery, again, is very nice. The uh, forward facing seats so you can travel with passengers and that centerpiece comes out so they can get their feet on the floor. Nice spacious lounge. There's a cocktail table there and then there's another one which goes in the middle of the floor if so desired. There are two sets of carpets with this camper as well. And then a good size kitchen. Oh, oh. There's another light switch under there somewhere, but. Uh, good size kitchen, full size oven, and um, um, three gas burner hob with one electric microwave. And then the large Tepford Frid freezer is over here. It has got the benefit of habitation air conditioning, expensive option. It's got a self-seeking satellite on it. It's got Avtex televisions, 12 volts. And then uh, these are very, very popular with the island bed. And one can get out of bed without disturbing the other. The mattress is unmarked. There's another Avtex television here. This all comes with the camper. And then your bathroom is here. So you've got a separate shower with a duckboard. Tepford uh, C250 swivel electric flush toilet and integrated sink. Uh, when I'm six foot one, I can stand up in there, plenty of room. Very good bathroom.
there's some little bits of chipping on the edge of the uh, hob here but that's very common so that can be rectified if required other than that uh, I can't say anything detrimental about the interior at all it's been truly loved this camper the guy who had it before was fastidious whenever it needed a service um, habitation and engine service he always put it into a main dealer to have that done so there's stacks of service history with this camper um, in fact, there was a bill for, I think, last year for sort of two and a half thousand pounds where he asked the main dealer, I think it was Chelsea Most Homes, just to tidy up a few bits and pieces here and there. Uh, I think it was a little bit over the top, but uh, anyway, that's what he was like. He was fastidious about his camper. So being maintained to a very high standard. Okay, that completes Serenity Leisure's video for this 2011 Contiki 679.